First, College Station residents have the opportunity to provide feedback on the future of the Southeast Park tonight. Now, Southeast Park in College Station was formerly known as the Texas Independence Ballpark, but that project was put on hold because of soil conditions that would have required extensive remediation. Now, that property is located off Rock Prairie Road near William D. Fitch Parkway and the Midtown area of College Station. Right now, city leaders are having an open house to talk about all of this at City Hall, and that is where we find our Donnie Tuggle. Donnie. Rusty, Katie, residents are discussing options from splash pads to bike paths to mixed trails. The city will soon take those suggestions from the public, take them to city leaders later on this year. The future 68-acre park is located in Midtown College Station on Rock Prairie Road near William D. Fitch. Suggestions for Southwest Park include the addition of a body of water, a splash pad, a bike trail, or a playground designed to encourage creative play. Originally intended to be the site of the Texas Independence Ballpark, will now be repurposed into a community park due to soil-related issues that would have cost more than $10 million to remediate. The city says one bit of misinformation that has been going around is that the site is contaminated from a nearby landfill, something they say is not accurate. So to our knowledge, the, the land is not contaminated by the landfill. It's actually just the soil that's out there isn't compacted properly, so the water is getting trapped in there and causing the soil to move too much. Um, but there's no contamination that we're aware of. If you couldn't make it out to tonight's open house, there's still time to provide feedback. We have that information on how you can do that right now with this story at KBTX.com. Reporting live tonight in College Station, Donnie Tuggle, News 3. Donnie, thank you.